Alright guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be checking out the new free marketplace content here for the month of May. Uh, basically, I'm just going to go ahead and download each and every single one, throw it onto a project and go check it out. Alright, so we're in here first. We got all of our content packs. We're going to start first with the drivable car. We got the SUV, the hatchback, and the sedan. So let's go ahead and start over here. Let's go check out the interiors. Really nice, really detailed. You can see that has a really high level of detail. I mean, even the tires, you can see here, the details. Let's go check out the hatchback. Kind of like the colors on this one. Okay, let's go over to the SUV. Got pretty much all the same interiors. We got three different LODs here. LOD one, you have your interiors. And then LOD two and three, you don't have any interiors obviously. And I mean, the third LOD here, you could probably use this for like, what, a mobile game or something? Okay, so this is the demo map here. Looks like we got a nice mountainous terrain over here and... Okay, you can press C to go into first person, that's really nice. Okay, and then see back to go in the third person. This is pretty fun, actually. We got some speed bumps. Oh, you can see the tires there. Oh, we got some ramps over here. I didn't even notice. Let's go check out these ramps. That's pretty cool. I really like the seat color here, the red. Oh dang, this right here is the one I want. Okay, this one's the one that's gonna catch all the air, boys. Let's check this one out. Yeah, that's pretty fun. Let's go ahead and check out some of the folders in here. Got our blueprint. Looks like we got our base car and then we have our child blueprints of that. Fairly organized, pretty nice. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out the next project here. Okay, so it's called the Materialized VFX. So it looks like we have a variety of uh, materials here. Let's go ahead and play it. All right, click the auto warp. All right, it's kind of a green color, greenish color. Then we got the blue here. It's pretty cool. That one, let's check out these ones right here. Right click to auto warp. Not really sure what you'd use this for. Oh, this kind of looks like a cool freeze effect here. Anyways, I don't really have much to say about this. All right, moving on. Let's see here. So we have the Modern City Downtown with Interiors Mega Pack. So we have a Modern City Map, Modern City Map Night, and then an Overview. Right off the bat, let's go ahead and zoom out and see this thing. Pretty big level. So I don't know where to start. Let's just start with the center of the town. Got this little monument, Washington Monument right here. It's like a... Egyptian kind of writing kind of like the park area Right over here. We got the best burger, which is like a little restaurant Got all your seats pretty high quality meshes. I would like to say got a little drink stands and um, It's a lot of checkout stands right there Pretty simple restaurant Then we go outside Across the street here, a little like dump truck sort of thing. 
Over here we got like a bank. And of course we have the bank teller area. The elevator. Just empty right there. But we actually have stairs right up here. So let's go ahead and check this out. Okay, so it looks like we have just a little office level. The stairs stop on this level. Um, pretty basic offices, I mean. Oh, we got some paintings here too. And I'm pretty sure this is all modular too, so you can really make whatever you want. Okay, this one doesn't look like we can go in it or anything. Okay, so this is the bank building. There's another building which is basically the same. Uh, this one doesn't have an interior. Same with that one. We have this little restaurant area, which is pretty nice. Um, police, do not cross. Okay, let's go check out the subway. Okay, so you have like this little metro, kind of fancy glass um, entrance in the subway. Okay, so we got on the stairs here. We got a nice security camera there. That's pretty cool. Um, go around the corner. It goes down again. And then we have like these little check through, whatever you want to call it. And then back through here, they don't have the train station or anything set up. Okay, over here, I think this is again another bank building. And I think that's pretty much it. Don't think there is anything much around here. Okay, there's another there's another best burger in the back. Didn't notice that. One thing that I actually found out or noticed with these cars is they actually have interiors in them. A blueprint that has separate meshes for the doors. Could potentially use to set up your own car. I mean, we have the blueprint right here, so theoretically you could just slap this into the blueprint there and actually make this drivable. Go ahead and check out what's next. We got the sci-fi robot. We got a different variety of these characters. I don't know if this is all. Yeah, I think it's just the same mesh with different textures. This guy over here has a nice looking cape over here, I want to say. Cloth physics and everything. Honestly, the textures really kind of make it look like they're different meshes, even though they're like the same model. A red and white color scheme. Looks like he's like some sort of medic or something. Honestly, I've got to say my favorite one out of all these is probably this guy with the cape. That's pretty cool. And then it looks like he's just rigged to the normal skeleton so just a basic sci-fi robot with its own anim animation blueprint i've got to say it has a lot of detail pretty cool pack i mean i could see myself using these sci-fi characters i don't know what i'd make i'd could probably make like my own little futuristic capture the flag or something let's move on to the last one which is the targeting system all right, so controls. Press T to target character. So T, E, Q. Huh. So I guess it's just like a combat target system or something. Kind of like an aimbot, honestly. Okay, so it really just looks like it's just a simple target system, whatever it uses for. I don't know, probably like a, if you're making some sort of RPG combat or something where you target a AI or maybe even some sort of aim assist if you're like playing on a controller. I think that's pretty much it for this pack. Uh, overall, I want to say my favorite pack is probably got to be between the drivable cars and the modern city. Alright, anyways, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed me just showing off the uh, new marketplace assets. Big thanks to uh, the creators of these packs as well as Epic Games for making this stuff free. And yeah, anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, I'm going to be making this probably a regular monthly thing where I download all the content and mess around with it. If you guys like this video, make sure you subscribe because I'm going to be making a lot more videos and tutorials. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.